Indonesia and Malaysia being two of the largest and most influential members of ASEAN and two countries have a long-standing relationship. For example, in economic cooperation, Indonesia and Malaysia are important trading partners within ASEAN and the two countries have also collaborated on various initiatives to promoting economic integration within the ASEAN, such as the ASEAN Free Trade Area and the ASEAN Economic Community. In the political, both of countries also work together on various regional political initiatives within ASEAN. For instance, both of countries have been involved in the ASEAN efforts to resolve the South China Sea disputes and promote regional security and stability. Both of countries also supporting people-to-people -people contact within the ASEAN to support the culture, socio-cultural community in ASEAN. So on behalf of the 42nd ASEAN Summit 2023 here in magnificent Labuan Bajo of East Nusa Tenggara, I had a chance to sit and walk with Yang Berhormat Senator Dato Sri Diraja, Dr. Zamri Abdul Qadir, Malaysian Foreign Minister. Minister Zamri, thank you very much for the time. Thank you, Adi, for having me. And welcome to Labuan Bajo, and congratulations for the first leader summit of the 42nd ASEAN Summit 2023 here in Indonesia. Thank you very much. So I would like to ask him about the current situation. How does the Malaysian government's view on its relation with Indonesia, and what step has it taken to deepen the bilateral relation between each other, Minister? Malaysia, Indonesia's uh, relationship has been quite comprehensive. Yeah and very strategic indeed. It's, it's, it's uh, you know, uh, mainly owing to our historical yes. uh, ties and a very close affinity in many ways. Uh, it has been going on for years. So uh, in the eyes of uh, M uh, Malaysian people, uh, Indonesia is, is so special uh, to us. Like Malaysian is like our brother and sister. It's like brothers. Yeah, we're sharing yeah. culture, we're sharing exactly. same languages Precisely. and thoughts sometimes. Uh, so, is there any specific collaborate more closely in a specific area, maybe in both all, countries? It's only from uh, if you look from the G to G perspective, mm -hmm. we have built uh, such a tremendous uh, relationship uh, in many ways. If you look at from you know economics. Uh, you know, uh, relationships and political security area. Right. Uh, that's precisely the area that we have to, to focus on. Uh, but at the same time, people-to-people's uh, uh, -people relation is, is another uh, very important perspective that we uh, have been working closely to see all this while. And uh, business to, uh, uh, to business is another area. Right. Uh, and. Uh, that's also embraced uh, the type of diplomacy that uh, we have been, you know, uh, building together all right. this while. It's, it's not only the officials, mm -hmm. uh, diplomacy is far, uh, form, but we also, uh, in terms of the, uh, you know, many cultural diplomacy, for example. In other words, uh, we are sharing a lot of uh, areas of um, uh, close, uh, what they call, uh, affinities in many affinities, ways. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, to elaborate, uh, you know, this is, is not suffice at this moment. But probably everybody knows uh, how close we are. So uh, we have to continue to look into this area to form our our relationship and maintain uh, the uh, current relationship that uh, we have now. Yeah, Minister Zamri, talking about the ASEAN itself, how Malaysian government see? the regionalism, the ASEAN itself, and how ASEAN could contribute more to making this region more stable, right. secure, mm -hmm. and prosperous in the future. Yeah, people have been asking about the relevance of ASEAN, for, but mind you, uh, we have been together uh, for the last 50 years or 50, more. Yeah. yeah. Right? Uh, so uh, it is a very important uh, regional cooperation that we have. Uh, it has been tested over time. Right. And then, uh, that shows uh, the uh, importance of ASEAN uh, in many ways and to create a region that is stable and peaceful for right. all peoples to work together. Right. So talking about the region itself, um, what is your thought, like Malaysian governments, to see the challenges posted by non-traditional, for example, um, terrorism, transnational That's crime? Great. and how Malaysian governments do might be making collaboration with yeah. within ASEAN members or Indonesia to tackle down the issues? Because we are so exposed to uh, 
uh, diff, you know, different kind of uh, uh, trajectories, uh, in terms of problems uh, that we right. are facing as well. This is so dynamic. This region is so dynamic. It's it therefore, is. Uh, you know, it, you can expect uh, uh, problems uh, might occur uh, from time to time, especially in in tackling this uh, the transnational crime. Right. Yes. So uh, uh, we we deliberated also in our uh, recent uh, meeting uh, among the uh, uh, foreign ministers yes. on the importance of. Uh, uh, Working together, right? Especially in, in tackling the scammers issues, you know, this is happening everywhere. Yeah. And then uh, it called for us to uh, to strengthen our ties to sharing information, uh, security information, uh, and uh, as such, we uh, been working closely uh, through the Interpol as well as ASEAN Interpol. This is kind of the example. Right. Uh, by um, you know, the sharing information is very important at, uh, at this stage. So we have been working on this, and then we, uh, we see uh, there are quite uh, good progress uh, uh, in, in tackling this issue together. I, let me cite one of the examples in the current uh, you know, scammers uh, issues involving people from Indonesia, Malaysia, mm -hmm. but uh, centered is somewhere in, in, in uh, one country. I don't countries, have to mention yeah. <laughs> countries uh, within the ASEAN. Right. But, uh, we work together on this, and then we, well, finally we managed to, uh, uh, to, to to save some of our peoples, and then Indonesian people, Malaysian, as well as uh, other countries, uh, to you know uh, save them from these uh, crime as activities uh, around Southeast Asia nation. Uh, Mr. Zambri, more into security. How does the Malaysian government view? with the role of ASEAN in promoting regional stability and security in the South China Sea and what step has we taken to manage tensions like between maybe the big countries in Southeast Asia or with other yeah. region? One important point is this, uh, we must not turn this uh, Southeast Asia mm -hmm. uh, nation uh, and, uh, and the South China Sea precisely right. on the issues of uh, the contestation of power. Uh, we have to avert that. Right. And as such, uh, all ASEAN uh, countries have been working closely uh, to ensure uh, peace and stability maintained uh, in the, uh, you know, in the in the current uh, geopolitical reality. Yes. The dynamic uh, so areas. The, the dynamic has yes. changed. And uh, however, uh, among ASEAN, all ASEAN members are fully aware of this. So we have to stand united uh, and then we come with one voice and then we should, uh, we, we, are, we have been resolved not to allow any form of, uh, right. you know, uh, any attempt from any side trying to uh, interfere into the, uh, uh, the affairs of uh, our uh, Southeast Asia uh, right. Association. That is very important for us. So far, and uh, thanks God, uh, all of us come in one voice. Uh, we have to continue maintain the spirit of uh, working together, uh, maintaining uh, Southeast Asia, and especially uh, in, in some of the, uh, uh, it, uh, the you know uh, the conflict, the, the possible conflicts yeah, that might uh, occur, so, so especially in the, uh, the uh, South China Sea. Yeah. So we, we are working that, and then uh, we have uh, voiced out our, uh, our views, our concern, and uh, all the time we come with one voice. That is very important. Yeah, we're us. working in our way, we're yeah. working in on the ASEAN, ASEAN way. way. Especially on the ASEAN centrality. Right. That is one of the major themes that uh, we have been working together. Indeed. So, so, uh, so far we've been working uh, very well. Indeed, Mr. Zamri, how does Malaysian government view and prospects all for deeper economic cooperation and integration in Southeast Asia region? Just moving forward uh, with, the, with, with, with the current reality and, uh, the, uh, and, the, tra and the trajectory right. uh, and that we are uh, having, I think uh, ASEAN is emerging and, uh, economically and is, uh, is going to be one of the uh, economic powerhouse. Uh, Indonesia, uh, you know, with uh, with a tremendous uh, 
uh, projections of the economic uh, progress, right. as well as Malaysia, Thailand, and the Singapore. rest. Singapore. Yeah, Singapore for that matter. And all ASEAN members uh, shows a very positive uh, trajectory. Therefore, uh, we, can, we can see this, uh, the uh, very uh, positive development. Right. Uh, uh, and in other words, uh, ASEAN must find its way to, for the economy in integrations uh, as uh, uh, we already testified through our um, AFTA uh, is one of the mechanism, a very strong me mechanism. Right. We are also having this, our uh, external parties of uh, countries coming together to work with, uh, with, with ASEAN. And we also have our ASEAN, ASEAN partners. Right. This is another uh, element that uh, uh, add to the, uh, the, the the vibrancies of, of, of uh, ASEAN itself yes. um, uh, to turn uh, uh, into the economic powerhouse. Uh, so we believe that through these efforts, uh, ASEAN we work together. However, uh, some of the issues uh, ASEAN uh, is facing, for example, uh, in the, in the uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, palm oil issues, uh, that requires right. our um, our uh, 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 cohesiveness, uh, and uh, especially uh, from Malaysia and Indonesia, for example, the two largest uh, producers of uh, palm oil, palm oil yeah, yeah. Con controlling 80% of the uh, the world productions. That that's one of the area that we have to uh, work with. and then and then we can see. Our, uh, Bapak Jokowi and, and Bapak Anwar, uh, they both have been working on yes. this. Uh, and then we come with one voice to, to address the issues of discriminations against uh, the EU's uh, you know, markets um, on uh, our uh, palm oil. Again, working so together. That's yeah? why we have the spirit of togetherness is yes. very important here. And, um, and also uh, the uh, on, on the possibility of using the uh, ASEAN currencies, that's another one. Uh, pa Anwar also uh, uh, talk about uh, using, uh, you know, uh, we create one uh, like form, single, fund, currencies, single, yeah. single currencies and ASEAN monetary fund. Wow. This is the new ideas, uh, I mean, it's real, um, the future ideas uh, for, for stri uh, strengthening ASEAN uh, cohesiveness. Right. Finally, Ambassador, what does Malaysian government's view on the challenges posed by the climate change in the region? We have to. The, you know, some countries in ASEAN has to change it. We have to change it to the green economy. Even now, people talk about uh, uh, ocean economy and yeah. uh, blue economy. Yes. That, you know, there are many terminologies being used now. Uh, I think uh, ASEAN members all that are all, uh, now moving to it. Uh, uh, climate uh, to issues of addressing of uh, issues of climate change, uh, as well as the uh, you know, looking into uh, the green technology, uh, because this is part of the conditions uh, for the future advancements in in, in economy. Uh, so uh, we have been working closely. Uh, mm -hmm. That, uh, among others, is uh, sharing um, uh, information, sharing resources. Uh, and uh, ASEAN, I can see uh, we have been working on that uh, closely. Right, Minister Zambri, yeah. thank you very much for the time. Thank you, thank you very thank much you for very having much. me once and again. And enjoy uh, the Second Leader Summit and Labuan Bajo of East Thank East you, Africa. thank you. So that was um, our talk, the special conversation with the Prime Minister Yang Berhormat Senator Dato Sri Diraja Dr. Zamri Abdul Kadir, Malaysian Foreign Ministers. My name is Aditya Warman, bye bye for now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Minister you. Zambri, thank, thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you so much.